Walter Pitts and Warren McCulloch created the first model of deep learning in 1943. This model was based on neural networks. They created the model on the concept of mimicking the human brain. They use a combination of mathematics and algorithms which they named threshold logic. Later, in the 1960s, Henry J. Kelly, an aeronautical engineer, first introduced the concept of backpropagation model. The first AI winter, brought on by unfulfilled promises, began in the 1970s. This lack of financing had a negative influence on both DL and AI research. Fortunately, several people continued the research on their own dime. At Bell Labs in 1989, Jan LeCun gave the first actual demonstration of backpropagation. On reading handwritten digits, he applied backpropagation and convolutional neural networks. In the meantime, handwritten checks with numbers on them were read using this method. During the period of 1985 to 1990, the second AI winter began which had an impact on deep learning and neural network development. In 1995, the support vector machine was created by Vladimir Vapnik and Dana Cortez, a system for mapping and recognizing similar data. 2009 was the year in which Fei Feili, an AI professor at Stanford, launched a free database of more than 14 million labeled images, named ImageNet. He quoted that, Our vision was that big data would change the way machine learning works. Data drives learning. In 2014, Ian Goodfellow developed Generative Adversarial Neural Network, GAN, a class of machine learning frameworks. Deep learning is still progressing very rapidly. In the upcoming videos, we will discuss the future of deep learning. If you find this video informative, hit the like button and subscribe to our channel.